Well, it's really evident that they had the skill and knowledge to survive. But at the same time, you look at this and a whole series of miracles was happening to say, yes, God is with, it, with you. With, with you. Brad, Mark, I've got you in the middle of this. Yes, you, you, you had an unexpected storm, but life comes at all of us with unexpected storms, and we need to know God is with us, that he is our very present help in time of need. Can you explain what happened to that shovel? No, Brad can't explain it. How can I explain it? I, I can't outside God is our very present help in time of trouble. If you're having it right now, if you're in the middle of difficulty, realize the, the crown of righteousness goes to those who overcome, who stand strong, who don't wilt under the pressure, but say, I know God is with me. He will see me through. If you're in that right now, we're going to pray we're going to agree with these wonderful promises from Scripture that we can call on because all the promises of God are yes and amen for those who are in Christ Jesus. If you need forgiveness for things that you've done wrong, and you've made mistakes, you've gotten into accidents or someone has done something to you, okay, uh, God's got an answer for that. He's got a promise for that. If you did everything right, but things came on you unexpectedly, well, God's got a promise for that one too. He wants to deliver his children. He wants to provide. He is a very good father. Now, before we pray, we want to encourage you. Here's some other miracles. Here's Edward from Memphis, Tennessee. He had spinal arthritis, excruciating neck pain. After three months, no medicine or treatment gave him any relief. So Edward decided to call on God, and he called the CBN prayer line. After prayer, Edward was instantly healed. He called over a month later to say the pain hasn't returned, and he gives all glory to God. That's amazing. Here's another one. This is Hilda, and she said, On December 21st of this past year, I was watching your program, and Gordon had a word of knowledge. He said that this person had her right hand on her right knee, which had been in pain for some time, and I claimed that healing, and the pain has been gone since. I was so thankful that I even spoke in tongues, which I have not done in some time. Praise God, there's no more pain blessings. That's incredible. Right. <laughs> Let's come to him. Let's come to him believing and believing some wonderful promises that Jesus Christ came to save sinners of whom I am chief. That's what the Apostle Paul wrote. He came to save us. He's not looking for your behavior. He's not looking for you to be good enough. He's looking for your heart to say, Daddy, could you help me? Could you be that present help in my time of trouble? Let's pray. Lord God Almighty, we come to you. We come to you humbly and say, yes, we have sinned. We have turned from your way. We have turned to our own way. Lord God Almighty, we ask now that you would become our salvation, that you would put us on the righteous path again. Be with us now. And we ask boldly at your throne of grace that you would stretch forth your hand to heal, that you would heal cancers, that you would heal hearts, that you would heal lungs, that you would heal minds, that you would heal frames, spines, hips, yes. knees, ankles, feet, Thank from the Lord. top of our head to the soles of our feet. May we be healed and be restored by you. Ashley, God's given you something. Yeah, I believe someone's watching with um, a hip issue. It's almost like you're, something with your pelvis. It's like tilted, it's shifted, and it's creating a lot of pain. You also have arthritis in your hips, and I believe God is healing this for you right now in the name of Jesus. That shifting will go back into place where it should be, and you will not have to struggle with this pain. You've been feeling it every single day. I believe God is touching your body, touching your hips right now, in Jesus' name, just receive it. Thank you, Lord. Uh, there's someone you're suffering with terrible mental confusion, and, and this is how you'll know it's you. You can't stay focused on one thing long enough to actually solve the problem. Your, your attention keeps drifting. You find it very hard to stay on one thing, to stay on task with your mind, to, 
focus your attention on one thing. God is healing you. He is giving you a sound mind. Just receive that right now. Just lift your hands to him. Let him baptize you in his Holy Spirit. Let him rearrange all of your thought patterns now. Let everything concerning you be normal and balanced and giving you the ability to overcome. Somebody else watching with an intense migraine, almost like a rubber band around your head. God is healing you and touching you right now. Migraine is leaving right now in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord. Amen and amen. If you need prayer, we're here for you. All you got to do is call us 1-800-700-7000.